Hello, everybody. I'm going live. In Even though it's, um, I'm on vacation. <laughs> but I wanted to, I miss you guys. I miss my clients. <laughs> I'm, um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I've decided to take like a two week uh, vacation in the summer, two weeks at Christmas, one week in February, and one week in October. Like, you know, I decided to structure them in. And it's really interesting for me because I haven't done that before. And I, I miss working, <laughs> but I am. I'm doing things in the background in between traveling, as you might have seen. I was in London. Tomorrow I'm going to the mountains. And yeah, it's been nice. I've been decluttering and you know, taking a step back. And I think that's really important as well in our businesses to get really clear. And also I have been studying Think and Grow Rich. Oh my God, I have so many underlines. It's incredible. It is such a powerful book and I cannot wait to teach on it starting on August 1st. Uh, you know, my program, my new 90 day program is called Elevate Your Money Consciousness. And um, I'm a bit hoarse, sorry. And um, yeah, I cannot wait to teach it. It's it's going to be around Think and Grow Rich. And oh my God, it's such a rich book. Not just, it's for all kinds of riches, for money riches, but also health riches, relationship riches. Um, it, the, the lessons in there are incredible. And I actually, you know, I was going to drop on the 1st of August, the pre-work of the chapter one, which is the introduction. It did the, and then after the introduction, there is 13 steps to riches. And I'm going to teach on one each week inside the Elevate Your Money Consciousness program. Um, I will teach on Mondays. And then every Tuesday, there will be a group coaching call. So it's going to be value packed. Plus lots of other bonuses that I don't even want to share because already that, you know, even if you're just to you know, focus on the Think and Grow Rich book, um, it would be incredible. But I also, like the Facebook group is opened and I've already dropped in there some great resources, including the movie, Think and Grow Rich. What's it called? Think and Grow Rich, The Legacy. That's what the movie is called. So, um, and it's really good. It's a really good accompaniment. And um, I want people to watch the movie before starting on the lessons because it's it's really good. But what I want to share now, let me just say hi. In, uh, say hi here on the replay, by the way. I want to quickly share before I go and play taxi for my daughter. Um, I want to quickly share, um, what do I want to share? The Olympics and the power of belief. Yes. Oh yeah. I'm, I'm looking, I'm, I was thinking, why am I on my phone? <laughs> Cause I want to share to check if anyone's online. No. Okay. Oh my God. Zero post reach. It's so bad. The reach. So I have to tag everyone afterwards. Otherwise nobody sees it. And I want you to see it. Okay, so let me just share um, the power of belief and the Olympics because what I have been doing is watching some Netflix. You know, I indulge myself on, on vacation and um, I always go for sports documentaries because what well, I did, I watched Bridgerton and Queen, Queen, what's her name? I can't even remember, not Queen Victoria. I can't even remember, but some great queen. It was a brilliant Netflix series. I cried a lot. Um, but um, what I really love is uh, sports documentaries because mindset. I'm just so passionate about mindset and um, I always learn something. So I watched Sprint. Ooh, la. loved it. Absolutely loved it. I'm watching Breakpoint now, the, the tennis legends. That's another great one. But um, Noah... Miles, I think it's Miles. I can't even remember. Um, so Noah Miles is the fastest runner in the world currently, and I'm excited to watch him in the Olympics now because you get to know them all in that great documentary uh, series called Sprint. But what I want you to do if you have Netflix, if not, I'm going to actually record it and I'll share it in the group. Um, I can screen record. He in the last episode. I love what he says. Actually, it's not only him, it's a few of them. Also the Jamaicans who are great runners, they have, they said, that, oh, they're not, they're not giving away their secrets. I'm convinced that their secret is that they've read and they apply Think and Grow Rich. I'm convinced of it. Um, there was one girl and she had like post-it note and, you know, there's several of them. They have the word believe. They're all about belief. And Noah I think it's Noah, is it Giles or Miles that's annoying me now? I have to check because I'm following him on Instagram and he keeps on coming up because the Olympics are in a few days. I'm so excited. So um, let me just check what his name is again because, oh, also the gymnast. Oh my God, I can't remember her name either. Lyle, 
Noah Lyles and the, the gymnast is Simone. Uh, I can't remember her name either. God, you can tell I'm not so like this. It's pretty, Simona B- Biles. Biles? Yeah. <laughs> Interesting. They're similar names. But um, in the last episode, Noah, we'll call him Noah, my buddy Noah. <laughs> he And I, he could be my buddy, you know, why not? I'll manifest meeting him because all you have to do is, and he says it in the last episode, like hold the vision and believe it. And I really, you know, I understood. It's like he just sees himself winning that race and it's like, let go of the how. Now, obviously that doesn't mean that I'm going to, compete in the next Olympics and win a gold because you know it has to be something that you genuinely would believe right so um but he, the way he describes it it's that mindset and it's definitely it's a lot of the think and grow rich philosophy I mean think and grow rich goes a lot more in depth and I'm so excited to share all the lessons but he's definitely a student of that you just it all starts with mindset with the power of belief so I want you to um, get a takeaway from this. I want you to really get that. And and you might know this already, but let me just reinforce it for you. That holds the vision, believe that it's possible with absolutely unwavering faith and trust that circumstances will align in order for you to achieve it. It's not going to work if you have doubt. So it really is like mindset work is my mindset work is seriously a skill to develop and part of mindset work is faith and belief in yourself and in your ability to achieve whatever it is that you want to achieve mindset work is not having doubt mindset work means certainty and it's a skill to develop and inside elevate your money consciousness i'm going to be talking about that a lot we will first decide our goal you will have a chief a definite definiteness of purpose, right? Um, your your chief aim, it's also called by Napoleon Hill. And that's the first thing that you're going to learn. You're going to just to, to get clear on what that is. And then you're going to visualize it. You're going to do lots of things with it. <laughs> but what you're not going to do is doubt your ability to achieve it, right? There might be challenges in the middle along the way, but you'll have the skills, you'll learn the skills of how to navigate those challenges, how to deal with that, because there is an incredible magic. I will share with you something that I've underlined. And this is, you know, um, the famous poem by Henley, I don't know his first name, how huh? you're the master of your fate, the captain of your soul. And let me just read this for you. It's just delicious. I just, it's like... So powerful. He said, um, Napoleon Hill talks about him in the introduction in chapter one. He said, he says that Henley should also have told us that the ether in which the, this little earth floats, in which we move and have our being, is a form of energy moving at an inconceivably high rate of vibration, and that the ether is filled with a form of universal power which adapts itself. It adapts itself to the nature of the thoughts we hold in our minds. It adapts itself to the nature of the thoughts that we have in our minds. Let that sink in. (laughs) And influences us in natural ways to transmute our thoughts into their physical equivalent. This power makes no attempt to discriminate between destructive thoughts and constructive thoughts. That it will urge us to translate into physical reality thoughts of poverty just as quickly as it will influence us to act upon thoughts of riches. He should have told us, too, that our brains become magnetized with the dominating thoughts which we hold in our minds, and by means with which no man is familiar. These magnets, they magnetize. This is also very closely linked with Dr. Joe Dispenza's work. If, you, if you're in my um, um, uh, Meditation for Transformation Facebook group and you've followed the teachings in there, we, we talk about magnetizing. You know, med- You go into a meditation, you send the thoughts out, and then you magnetize that vision with your heart. It's a science, it really is. So um, the mas- those magnets attract to us the forces, the people, the circumstances of life, which harmonize with the nature of our dominating thoughts. Boom. I mean, I have read Think and Grow Rich more than once, but a long time ago, and I have been implementing it and definitely it works, but I'm so much more 
um, knowledgeable, knowledgeable now, I have so much more understanding because with Dr. Joe Dispenza's work, which really complements this work, I really believe it now. And I think before I had so much doubt, but you cannot have any seeds of doubt. And that is the power of mindset work. So exciting. Like I said, it's delicious. I mean, that information is available to us and it's up to us to learn it, but also to implement it. And you know what? You might say, oh yeah, well, I can just read the book on my own. What you will experience in this program will be at a much higher level than reading the book on your own. I mean, I read it already, kind of scanned it, but this we're going to go in depth. There, what, the nugget that I've shared with you just now, there are so many more of them, but then you'll also be applying it practically, really living it for 90 days. So I really hope that you're going to join us inside Elevate your money consciousness. You can also apply it to your health, elevate your health consciousness or your relationship consciousness. It's success consciousness. And that's another thing I underlined. He says, basically, you know, the book is about going from failure consciousness to success consciousness. So you can apply that to anything in your life. You get to choose, you get to decide at the start of the 90 days and, um, and then impl implement the 13 steps, which I share over well, over 14 weeks, the week one is the introduction, and then there's uh, 13 weeks. I cannot wait to share. I think, I know, I'm certain <laughs> that this program is going to be my best yet, and it's really reasonably priced. I suspect that there will be great results from it. I also suspect that it will go up in price. The group program option is really reasonably priced. You can actually get in at uh, three installments of $197, so you can already get in at $197. And for that, you get all the lessons, plus a group coaching call, um, weekly group coaching call every Tuesday. Plus there's gonna be 10 lessons around money, you know, the like the practical, you know, just additional for your money mindset, right? Uh, going through your money history. And I will drip feed those slowly because I don't want to overload you, overwhelm you. Um, I really want you to um, have a great experience on this program. If you have followed the trainings inside um, Meditation for Transformation, the weekly lessons, it will be similar to that, the lessons um, where I summarize and I use slides to teach. Um, but this is going to be better because... I've decided, you know, so I just decide it and then you believe it and then you achieve it. <laughs> That's how it works. And, you know, to be in that energy where everybody else is on that same journey and masterminding together, which Napoleon Hill, it's um, that is one of the steps to riches, actually. Um, so we're all going to be in there together. So that's going to naturally elevate your vibration. And um, it, it's going to be a really powerful experience. I would be very surprised if you don't get um, uh, more than a return on your investment at the end of the 90 days. Also, of course, you know, in the weekly group coaching, you know, if you've got questions related to business, if you've got questions related to an idea, because by the way, he also shares in chapter one about the power of just one idea is all you need. And he suggests that you get that idea at some stage, it will drop in during the reading of the book. What I would recommend is that you watch the movie, which is inside the Facebook group, and that you also have your own copy of the book and that you pre-read it yourself and underline it. And then in the group coaching calls, we'll discuss, you know, what was your favorite takeaway? What did you underline? Plus, I will be inviting you all to share um, those takeaways inside the Facebook group to post that to help each other. You know, don't keep the takeaways in your ahas that you'll get to yourself and to share stories too. So going to be great. So I really hope you're going to join. Also, of course, you can join Fired Up Coach, which is still on special offer until the end of July at 997 for the year. So you'll get a year of group coaching, plus in all members of Fired Up Coach get this for free, which is incredible. Or you can work with me privately and go really, really deep on um, getting your business going fast and um, yeah, removing all those blocks. Woo! By the way, it's really warm in Geneva and I always get really hot when I share live stream. <laughs> so I'm quite sweaty now. Um, I've been, I've had the shutters closed because, uh, yeah. And poor Sasha, and my dog, she's like, what, what the heck? Because it's just uh, too warm. I just opened them now to let light in for this live stream. But yeah, man, it's hot. So I'm excited to go to the mountains tomorrow. It'll be cooler. We're going to a lake. I'll share some photos.
<laughs> okay, lots of love. Thanks for tuning in and be sure to comment below. Bye.